when you've gone through the process of formatting a section, so for example, we've made this block look the way we want it with lines, with currency, with nice colors, it can be a bit soul destroying to now have to redo it again over here. So Excel has come up with a way that you can copy the formats. So there's two ways of doing it. The one we showed you previously. If I highlight and copy a section and I click over here, under Home, Paste Special, you'll see there's an option called Formats. And what that's going to do is paste all of that but only the formats. So when I say OK, it does that and you'll see the formats look the same. I'm just going to undo because there's actually a shortcut way of doing it and you'll see there's something here called a Format Painter. So what I can do, I can highlight that. If I click on the Format Painter once, it's now waiting for me to tell it where it must apply that formatting. So notice that it's got a little paintbrush next to the cursor. When I click once, notice that the formatting applies, but can you see the paintbrush has disappeared? I'm just going to undo. If let's say I've now decided, I'm just going to manually do the currency. If I click it once, and I go and change that one there, you'll see when I try and click the others, it doesn't work. What I could have done is gone, clicked on Format Painter, and highlighted the whole lot. When I let go, they all assume that formatting. But what happens if I now want to only do it here? So I've had to. I can do it in one swoop, but then I have to let go. So what you can do is choose the cell that represents the format you want. And over here, you don't single click, you double click. And what Excel now knows to do is to keep formatting until you tell it not to. So I want that one done, this one done, that one, etc. So you can then go through and individually pick. You can do more than one and you'll see the paintbrush stays there. It will stay there until you either click on this cell or this block or you push your escape key and it will go then back to normal without affecting the actual formatting.